Hi YouTube, how you doing? Have you ever wanted to create pictures and then you know retouch them? And most of the times you want to do that with Photoshop, but then you don't really know how Photoshop works, and it really works like difficult, and so you don't understand it. And you are like wanting to create special kind of pictures, you know. And um, I want to show you this program. I use it for a while already. This is version 10. They already have version 11, but it's called Portrait. Um, <clears throat> let me show it to you. It's called. Uh, oh, <laughs> I'm swinging my camtasia. Yeah, I'm sorry about that. It's called Portrait Professional. And what can you do with it? Well, <laughs> as you can see, you can make crazy pictures. Um, you can retouch your pictures and you know make them like spacey or like a cartoon or you know just a little bit different and I'm gonna show you how it works it's really easy we say open we start with uh, a new project what is this yes okay um, hold on let me turn off the cam I'm gonna turn off my webcam hey, how do I do that no webcam anyway I cannot turn it off I think also okay we're resuming whatever uh, we are gonna get a picture okay we take this picture this one wasn't retouched as you can see um, yep okay so this is the picture you can then choose what are you a male or a female of course I'm a male and then we are gonna put in sizes for the pick for the program to know exactly where the right spots are of your mouth so there we go and now we're gonna make the eyes a little bit we're gonna fit everything into so the program knows exactly that is your eye so it will not do unnatural things you know we can make it a little bit smaller like this you see and then the eyebrows yeah like this I think something like this and then you hit space and we make it a little smaller like this these we also need to make a little bit smaller it's too big this one as well like this and then we take them both and put them there this one we make a little bit bigger as you can see that is the outside of your eyes and this was okay this was nearly okay so now we hit space the mouth is open so we say mouth open we press we pull this here put the lips in line you see that program works really nice this one you pull up to there and this one put there and this can go a little bit there and here just a little bit more so how about that now we can look at the sides here put them here we can put the side of the face so like this like this you see that now we have the whole face neatly so there you go now we hit space again and now it will create a new you Might be a little bit slow because we're recording at the same time. My processors are working like crazy. Oh, look at that! <laughs> look at that! All right, that was me, and this is me now. Okay, all right.
young natural you can choose here reset to the original you see and you can say you're a young woman but I wouldn't do that because <laughs> you see what happened to the face the face got really strange <laughs> Uh, okay. Yeah, um, change to Windows 7 Basic. It's all good, baby. So, um, we have all sorts of young men. And this should be then the first one. <laughs> Look. And, um, yeah, you can do several things here at the side. You can see. Uh, that you can this uh, profile I created myself eh? so you know this is my start but your start will be like original and then you can play around with it I was already playing with it and you start of course here on top you can see show face scope controls and up here you can like see make your face but this was original this is my normal head <laughs> and now you can make it a little easy and the nose you can make the nose a little smaller or bigger I like my nose the eyes you see you can get, give yourself a little bit harder face like a boxer but that is not my intention uh, mouth shape you see you can get the mouth like that like a real bastard <laughs> or you leave it like that I'll just put it like I think like this is real nice I'll leave it like this okay so now we go to the skin controls and up here you can see that you can do several things you can do uh, the in imperfections imperfections are the not so perfect uh, spots on your skin you can then just like like this you can also touch a brush and then you know I, I will not do too much now because we're also recording Thin wrinkles, master fade. You see, and this was a touching I already did, eh? so the effects won't won't show too much. Let's go to the eyes, but in your case, it will do all sorts of beautiful things. Eh? Here we can work with the brightness. This is the brightness. You must also look what part of the skin you're working at. Eh? this is the master master fade uh, of the uh, skin area so now we go to the eye controls let's say you want to have green eyes you know you want to buy these lenses and you don't know you want to see how it looks with you then you just go to change eye color and up here we can change them to brown you see that Oh, look at that and now they will be green you can buy these things eh? but these are more my <laughs> look at that man and now we can also make um, the eye amount of change bright and iris or make it black <coughs> see this is really nice I think this is really really beautiful like this okay uh, mouth and nose control well you already know that here you can give the lips some you make them green Oop. <laughs> oh man that looks bad we leave it original so and uh, I think that's it and then 
you go to next here on top and you say save as and you save it as a uh, new puck save saving the image I hope that my sound is not breaking up that would be so sad but that's it that's how to uh, <laughs> make a and of course I could do it a little bit better uh, up here I could also do some touching you see that here I can do the touching I forgot the little part there here on top also you see that look at the top of the head I'm making it really nice and see that oh look at that baby oh look look at my t-shirt I'm making my t-shirt black see that look at that that's how to do it and up here I can also go over my over my woolen uh, to also give it some effect you see that look at that make it a little darker give it some more you know <laughs> I just made my my teeth a little bit black <laughs> <laughs> so look at that I think I look pretty good I could just go and play in a movie don't you think look at that man I look like a movie star let's save this baby save not bad that man wow super puck okay then we close this program and we go back to Camtasia oh we're still on cam I thought I turned off the cam so that's it and this program of course how can you find it well um, the name of the program is picture portrait portrait what is it portrait professional studio that's what it's called and if you want to find it of course you need to go to um, you need to go to Google and let's see if we can find the site they will show you the the latest uh, version what was it portrait professional studio or oh, of course I turned off my internet portrait professional studio professional studio you don't have to diagnose nothing oh, I'm stupid. Oh, stupid okay uh, what was it named again oh, what is this now then go away portrait professional studio Portrait Professional Studio. Let's see. Portrait Professional Studio. There it is. It's at portraitprofessionalstudio.com. And up here you can download the latest free trial. And I can tell you version 11 is really 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 cool because you don't have to put up these lines anymore yeah you just have to correct them a little bit but they will just the program will just find the eyes and you know it has uh, face uh, motion control how you say that face uh, whatever you call that so it will just find the face so version 11 is more improved then uh, version uh, 10 but I think uh, version 10 for me it's good enough I can make <laughs> crazy creatures of myself I think let's look, take a look at that picture again this one is also one I made with the same program look at that 
I put it on Facebook, but I removed it again. I thought it looked it looked stupid. <laughs> That's just not me, man. But still, I think it looks nice eh? if you do modeling things or so or whatever, you know. I think maybe then it looks nice. Look at this. I really look like a bastard, man. Look at that. Oh, I look like a fuck, like a killer, man. Like a serial killer. Wow, that looks nice. Mm. This one I also made today. This was uh, from my friend Sanela. I think it's a beautiful picture. Did I make this one? Was it this one? I think it was not this one. Where is it? The one I made from her. Oh, it, here it is. This is the one I made. You see? That's different from the one you just saw. This one I still have to do. But don't you think this is beautiful? Look at that. It's it's different than, than a normal picture. It looks like a painting, you know. I think it's beautiful. And that's not me. That's a guy that wants to look like me, but that's not me. Oh. Mm. I think I look better on cam, right? This is me, the real. And that is the fake me. Man. This girl looks banging, yo. You see, they also did her face, eh? This is also not real, eh? This is not real. But when you use good lights and you make a good professional picture, <coughs> not one with your with your phone, like I just did, but a professional picture, then you can, you know, if you look at the quality of this picture, then you will see that it's really, really good. Look at the girl's face. But you can see in the little lines that this picture has been you know they worked on it it's not like she's there and you know maybe these are not even her real color eyes you can do everything with the program it's really beautiful yeah this is the original I still think that this picture don't look good but it doesn't matter nevertheless uh, I think Sanela was the best picture I, I created with this program until now for today I think it's beautiful you could just put it in a little list and you know sell it for 10 euros and say this is uh, Lona Lisa <laughs> Lona Lisa, this looks like a painting. Uh, don't you agree with me? It looks like a painting. It looks beautiful. I put it on, on Facebook, and in not even five minutes, it get more than fifteen uh, thumbs up. So, good program. So that's how to do it. I hope you uh, learned something today. It's easy to install. You just download it, put in your email, and then you install it, and then you can start it up and run it and enjoy it and you know make nice pictures and also make a nice picture from your mommy you know from your mom and then make it nice see you next time and thank you for watching and this was Spock until my next video bye now